Hi everybody, it's Miss Rachel, and today we have to talk about our new letter this week. Our new letter is the letter D. The first thing we have to do is practice writing it. So let's put our fingers up in the air. Ooh. We have to go down, pick it up, back to the top, and around. Nice, let's try that again, okay? We start at the top, we go down, pick it up, back to the top, around. Nice job. Now we have to try the lowercase d. Let's put our fingers to the top. We go down, pick it up just to the middle, around. Let's try again. Start at the top, down, pick up to the middle, around. Good job. All right, let's talk about some things that start with the letter D. So I tried to draw some pictures. Hopefully we know what they are. <laughs> All right, our first thing that starts with the letter D is a D, 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 dinosaur. Did you say dinosaur? Good job, D for dinosaur. Our next thing that starts with the letter D is, what's this? A D, D, dolphin. Good job. Dinosaur, dolphin. Let's see what's next. Oh, this is very shiny. It's a D, D, diamond. A lot of people have these on their rings. Diamond. Let's see another D word. Ooh, a delicious D, D, donut. D, D, donut. Next we have, oh, we could play this in our music class. D, D, drum. The D, 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 drum. Nice. And the last one is a D, D, duck. Okay, so our D words are D, dinosaur, D, dolphin, D, diamond, D, Donut, the drum, the duck. Good job. All right, we are going to sing a little song. Mom and Dad, in the email, I sent out um, a Word document that's going to be this poem. So if you want to set them up with that, or they could just listen to it, it doesn't matter, but they could do this at the same time as me if they have that in front of them. So I'm gonna sing you this poem or song about our letter D and it's about um, an animal. Does anybody know what kind of animal it is? Look around, see if you could figure out what kind of animal it's gonna be about. It's about a dog. Now, does this look like a girl dog or a boy dog? Let's look. Hmm. It's probably a girl because she's wearing a pretty pink bow. So maybe she's a girl. All right. It goes, a dandy dog dug on my deck and Daisy was her name. Daisy likes to dance. Daisy likes to dance. Daisy likes to dance for she's a dandy dog. All right. We're going to do that again. Ready? A dandy dog dug on my deck and Daisy was her name. Daisy likes to dance. Daisy likes to dance. Daisy likes to dance for she's a dandy dog. Nice. Okay. So what we're gonna do together is we have to now be detectives and try and find all of the D's in our song. And there's a lot of them. So let's start at the very top. Here's our capital D. Let's go through our song and see how many capital D's we can find. The ones that look like this. So let's look at our first line. Look around and come up and help me see if you could point to anything that looks like a capital D. Do we have any capital D's here on the first purple line? 
No, no capital D's there. Let's look at our second line, the green line. Hmm, look around, come up and point for me. Where is a capital D? <gasps> Did you find it? The capital D. So on your paper too, let's circle our capital D. Nice. Let's look at our next purple line. Where is a capital D? Look around. Come up and point. <gasps> there it is. Circle it on your paper too. The next one's a green line. Look around for capital D. Come help me and point to it, please. I need your help, please. Where's capital D? <gasps> there it is. We'll circle it again. The next purple line, hmm, capital D. <gasps> we found it, circle yours too. Are you going, going along circling? And our last green line, do we see any capital Ds? Hmm, nope, zero. Let's count all of the capital Ds. One, two, three, four. Four capital D's. So up here, I'm just gonna write the number four next to our capital D. So we know capital D had four. Now we have to go around looking at our lowercase d. I think we're gonna find a lot of these. So let's look at our first line, the purple one. Hmm, look around. We have a lot to point to. Come on up and help. Point for me. Oh my goodness, I think I see so many. Here's a lowercase d. Any more? Here's a lowercase d. Here's a lowercase d. And here's a lowercase d. And there's a lowercase d. Holy moly. That was one, two, three, four, five, just in our first line. Whoa. All right, let's try our green line. Let's see if we see any lowercase d's. There it is. All right, circle yours too. Lowercase, nice. Now let's go through again. On our purple line, where is another lowercase d? Can you come up and point to show me? There it is, circle. Let's go to our green line. Any lowercase d's? Hmm. We found it. Circle again. And our purple line, lowercase d's. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Can you find it? There it is, D. And our last green line, a lowercase d. Do you see any? I think there's a couple. Can you come up and point for me? There's one, and I think there's one more. Do you see it? There it is. Good job. Now let's go around and count our lowercase d's. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven lowercase d's. So let's write that up here next to the lowercase d. So we had four capital D's and eleven lowercase d's. Which one had more? Hmm. So which number is bigger? Which letter had more? Four capital D's or 11 lowercase d's? Hmm, the number that's bigger is 11. 11 is bigger. So which letter had more? The capital or the lowercase? The lowercase. Lowercase d had more. Nice job. So which letter had less? Hmm, let's first look at the numbers. We have 11 and four. Which one is smaller? Hmm, 11 or four, which one is smaller? 
four smaller. So which letter did we have less of? Capital D or lowercase d? We had less capital Ds. Nice job. All right, this week, you're gonna have lots of D work to do. We have a couple stories for you that you're really gonna like. We have our writing, math. You're gonna have to look at your own pictures and the pictures that we did before and see what starts with the letter D that makes that D, D, D sound. And some art, some art and sensory activities. Okay, I hope you had fun with me today and I'll see you guys again soon. I miss you guys so much. When I do see you, I'm gonna give you giant hugs because that's how much I miss you. All right, I'll see you guys soon. Bye. Mwah.